Good morning, you beautiful soul. Today's inspiration comes from Glennon Doyle. She is an author and activist. Her quote is, I stopped being a quiet peacekeeper and started being a loud peacemaker. My anger was good. This is something every woman who is committed to a spiritual life must come to terms with. While focusing on the positive and praying and envisioning change you want to see in the world are all good practices, very often our feet and voices are needed even more than our prayers. Most women on a spiritual path of positive change have to eventually decide if they're going to put action behind their thoughts and prayers. Love is an action word. We need to use our voices and march our feet next to our sisters who are carrying an even heavier burden because of the color of their skin. Speak up. If you're going to be the change you want to see in the world, remember that all changes in the world happened because of action that somebody took. There is strength in numbers. Which side do you want to be counted on? The side who sat quietly on the side praying or the side who took appropriate action when it was needed? The status quo doesn't applaud loud women demanding change. We know that for sure. And that's okay. We're not doing this for the status quo. We're doing it for ourselves. We're doing it for each other. And today, as you go about your day, the one thing you can do for yourself is be kind to yourself. You are worthy of kindness. The kinder you are to yourself, the more mercy you will foster for yourself. And when you're being kind and merciful with yourself, you're fostering the ground for grace. And once grace comes, that's all you'll ever need. Be kind to yourself today.